Welcome to episode 1100 of the Multifamily Collective. Uh, quick reminder, head over to multifamilycollective.com, sign up for the weekly rundown newsletter. The subscription rate is starting to amp up. I'm very excited by that because we are sharing lots of interesting information over there, uh, kind of taking the labor out of reading articles that I think are germane to the business, germane to the economy, etc., and giving you a quick synopsis so that you don't have to read the whole thing if you don't want to, but it is there if you do want to, and then sharing some other neat stuff. But uh, topic today is one that I learned uh, the value of serving and not to suggest that I am the pinnacle of servant uh, leadership or, or service in general, uh, but I did see a representation of service that I thought was incredible. Uh, Jody Johnson, the person that I used to work for when I was selling single family homes at Remax, uh, when I very first uh, started in the real estate industry back in a long time ago. <laughs> anyway, I was riding around with jo uh, Jody Johnson in, the, in her car one day. She was mentoring me on some aspect of the real estate business and uh, she happened to try to get something out of her purse and out of her purse back then uh, the way that you were paid uh, was with a real physical check uh, and uh, she was trying to get something out of her purse and in like I don't know 10 or 15 commission checks and then we're talking thousands and thousands tens of thousands of dollars uh, fell out of her purse and I looked at him and my eyes got as wide as saucers and I said whoa like uh, why like can you carry these around she said oh I just it's I'm so you know I'm so busy I uh, I don't I don't uh, I don't usually get a chance to run to the bank too often <laughs> to deposit these things and so anyway we got into this long conversation about why it was why she was so busy so such that she couldn't get her money in the bank and she more or less in a, a very non-assuming way told the story about really putting her customer first and serving him at the highest level and giving them uh, all of the time and attention that they needed as they were walking through what is what is the biggest purchase in most people's lives and that is a home and uh, the dedication and the commitment that she made to her customers uh, 24 7 whatever they needed whenever they needed it she would provide that for them and as a result um, I'm not celebrating this because I certainly think that uh, there is a different uh, mentality today in terms of work-life balance back then there were there really was no work-life balance it was serve 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 to the detriment of everything else in your life um, however that being said uh, apply modern day standards to what Jody did for her customers uh, and the lesson is without service, without commitment to customers, without service and commitment to team members, businesses don't run, businesses don't operate and they certainly don't do it in an optimal way uh, if you sacrifice those things. So my encouragement to you today is to serve uh, like no tomorrow because that is a differentiating factor in your business and it will be on a go forward. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.